bu inem. Got some music. <laughs> oh! What's your name? Paul. Paul's got live music by the Victoria Oval. Who's this we're talking to? My name is Réjean. Réjean. Lavoie. Bonjour, Réjean Lavoie. <laughs> Enchanté. <laughs> All right. Music by Paul Craig. Rinkside. Here we go. Let's compare this to yard skating on my last video. in Alberta, February 13th, 2022, plus five degrees now, 11.30, gorgeous, gorgeous day. It was actually plus five or so in the last few weeks and ice was questionable coming into this weekend. Almost left at my skates at home because of that, but glad I did bring him and getting to enjoy the the ice. Let's go for a quicker lap here. Feels good to be skating again. We got the shack for all the storage of the pylons and pucks for speed skating. Zamboni shack. Actually, Zamboni shack's right there, tied to the main building. Chalet. On a cold day, it's a nice place to warm up, but it's so nice, most people are getting ready inside or outside this morning. And the club headquarters right here. You got some uh, bikes to warm up and some lockers. But yeah, these, this is the new facilities at the Victoria Park Oval. Usually, a skating oval has just a surrounding 400 meter track. And what's special about the Edmonton track is the whole block is actually prepared 
skatable. And when the club times, they skate on the outside and usually the public gets skate in the middle. It's owned by the city. The club has its part with the Zamboni and preparing the skating, uh, the speed skating track. Well, what a morning. Don't tell anyone. This is a like a gem. It's a secret. If ever this gets out, I mean, everybody would be here. I mean, more like one of those ovals in Amsterdam with uh, thousands of people on it here. What, maybe 40, 50 now? Maybe it'll get busier this afternoon. But excellent family activity. There is a lot of families here this morning. And uh, spend the rest of this weekend visiting with family here. Over and out. Thanks for joining.